Saudi Arabia is building a real-life Wakanda, and it's going to cost them a staggering $500 billion to do it. The brainchild of Saudi Crown Prince Mohammed bin Salam, the mega-smart city Neom is going to transform Saudi Arabia, and there are plans to make it the most technologically advanced city in the world, where people will fly in air taxis to work and robots will be in charge of the household chores. Neom will rise from the arid plains of the desert and will become an El Dorado for investment, a major tourist destination for travelers, and a haven for its lucky residents. Why is the country building Neom, and what's so special about it? Let's find out. Before we begin though, make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it, and subscribe to Tech Division. Now, let's get into it. Saudi Arabia is exploring new ways to make money. Most people are aware that Saudi Arabia became super rich because it is an oil-rich country. That supply of oil might not last forever though, and undoubtedly some advisors have warned Crown Prince Salam about the importance of depending on something other than oil. In essence, the country can't continue to keep all its eggs in one basket. The prince, being the smart and future-thinking guy that he is, now has Saudi Arabia going into overdrive, working on several projects like Wadiya City, Amala, and the Red Sea Project. Neom however, is on another level altogether and will be so advanced that who knows how far they will go. The World's Most Ambitious Project Experts around the world are calling Neom the world's most ambitious project. It's currently planned to be a 16-borough city on the Red Sea coast in the northwestern part of the country, near Tabuk east of Egypt. The main reason for building Neom is to reduce the country's dependency on oil before its crude reserves run dry. The city is therefore being planned as a major business hub and tourist destination that will focus on nine investment sectors, energy and water, mobility, biotech, food, technological and digital sciences, advanced manufacturing manufacturing, media, and entertainment. Basically, it'll support industries that will drive the future of human civilization. The Kingdom of Saudi Arabia is inviting investments in these core areas and hope they will stimulate economic growth to create more employment and increase the GDP of the country. The Saudi government plans to hold multiple investors' summits in order to attract investments in this futuristic city. Currently, the $646 billion economy is still facing unemployment issues and low oil prices, so going all in on Neom is definitely a step in the right direction. What makes Neom completely unique is its potential to unite the best of Arabia, Asia, Africa, Europe, and the Americas as a cosmopolitan and unified area of investment and business. Neom will feature artificial intelligence everywhere. Neom is being planned in such a way as to integrate as much artificial intelligence as possible. It will also rely on sustainable and renewable energy sources, further reducing the reliance on and importance of fossil fuels. For transportation, it'll have robo-taxis, autonomous driving vehicles, and even air taxis, if that becomes feasible. The city's public transportation network will include a hyperloop and bullet trains, although roads will also feature bicycle lanes so citizens can move about freely. Neom will feature an unrivaled solar and wind energy system with the Saudi Arabian government encouraging new industry to drive the next wave of energy transition by producing green hydrogen. Neom will leverage inexpensive clean energy and integrate a carbon-free energy ecosystem. It will also be digitally advanced and provide free Wi-Fi for all residents. Neom is placed in a strategic location. Neom will be spread across a staggering 26,500 square kilometers and extend 460 kilometers along the coast of the Red Sea overlooking the Gulf of Aqaba. This means Neom will feature some amazing beachfront properties. Prince Salam assures Neom will be a friendly neighbor to an equally important tourist hub, the Egyptian city of Sharm el Sheikh, which lies on the opposite sides of the Straits of Tehran. In fact, Neom will connect with Sharm el Sheikh via a causeway. The ambitious project will also connect with North Africa via a land route from North Africa to the Arabian Peninsula, bypassing Israel. The fact that Neom is located on one of the world's most prominent economic paths, across which one-tenth of the world trade flows, makes it an extremely strategic location with the potential to grow rapidly and emerge as a global economic hub. It's estimated that Neom's location will enable 70% of the world's population to reach it in just eight hours. This will no doubt bring the best of global intelligence and input from across the world to Neom in terms of knowledge, technology, research, teaching, learning, living, and working. Construction has already started with LINE, a three-tier linear city. 
The Neon Bay Airport has already been built and opened in 2019. It allows for a direct connection to Riada. The largest part of Neon will be an exclusive complex of several palaces intended for use by Crown Prince Salam and other members of the royal family. Neon is being built with the help of three of the world's largest consulting firms, McKinsey & Co., Boston Consulting, and Oliver Wyman. These firms will advise Prince Salam on various aspects of the city's construction. Construction for Neon itself began in late 2020, with the first phase being called The Line, a linear city slated for construction in the first quarter of 2021. The Line will have no cars or streets. Instead, essential businesses and services will be easily accessible to residents via a short walk. The Line will feature three levels or tiers, with the top level being a pedestrian-only level, the second level being for logistics, services and infrastructure, and a ground level for transportation to and from the city. Neon will have some amazing futuristic features. Once completed, Neon will feature cloud seeding technology where artificial clouds will produce more rainfall than one would usually find in the desert environment. It will also have an artificial moon to illuminate the city at night. The city also aims to feature the world's best education system with digital learning being the prime focus. Teachers will impart education with the help of holograms. It sounds like something out of Star Wars. And that's not the only movie inspiration to be found in Neon because planning is also underway for its very own Jurassic Park. without the live dinosaurs, of course. Neom's Jurassic Park will be built on an artificial island and have lifelike robotic dinosaurs. As for the coastline, plans are being put in place to alter the coastline of the Red Sea and have glow-in-the-dark sand added to the beaches. That will certainly be a sight to see. It will run independently of Saudi Arabia. With the incredible planning that has gone into Neon, there really seems to be nothing negative about it. The city will run independently as an open laboratory for young entrepreneurs. Besides being geographically rich with its own coasts, mountains and deserts, the city will operate on its own framework, independent tax system and labor laws. Basically, it will be completely independent of governance by Saudi Arabia. The world cannot wait for Neon, which is expected to be ready between 2025 and 2030. Would you consider living in such a city? Let us know down in the comments below, and don't forget to like the video if you enjoyed it, and subscribe to Tech Division.